Danny, the duck with no quack by Malachi Doyle Illustrated by Janet Samuel Every morning the ducks and the hens gather in the yard for a good gossip. How is the quack, Danny? asks a chicken. What's the story? Tell us the news. But Dan is a shy little duck and he never knows what to say. He keeps his beak firmly shut, bows his head and turns away. Come on, Danny, squawked the birds one day. Don't be such a scary quack. There must be something you can tell us. Danny swallows and opens his beak, but nothing comes out. Not a beep, not a splutter, not a cackle, not a hoot. He's lost his quack. Right, thinks Danny, that's it. And he takes off up the lane to find the tale worth telling. Yes, he wanders up the track to find his quack. He waddles along and waddles along till he meets two scrawny foxes. Th this thing's heavy. Who'll help us carry it? That duck. And then he knows he shouldn't. These are tricky looking foxes. He opens his beak to say that he won't, but nothing comes out. We've carried far and far enough, groans one fox. Now who collect the wood? The duck with no quack sniffs the other. And then he knows he shouldn't. These are hungry looking foxes. He opens his mouth to say no, but he can't. Now who will fill the pot with water? asks one fox. The duck with no quack smirks the other. And then he knows he shouldn't. These are scary looking foxes. He opens his beak as wide as he can, and what does he say? Nothing. Now who will be the dinner? says one fox, licking his lips. The duck with no quack, cries the other, jumping up. They rush towards Danny, and they're just about to grab him when... Quackety quack, it's a duck attack, squacks Danny. He throws himself to the side of the pot. The two foxes are so surprised they tumble right aside. How's the quack, Danny? asked the other ducks when he rushes back to the farmyard. Yeah, what's the quack, duck? asked the hens. And aren't they all amazed to hear Danny quacking? Aren't they all astonished at the tale that he has to tell? I wandered down the track and I met a pair of foxes. They were carrying a pot and I knew that one they wanted to cut me. No, they made me gather wood. <gasps> Help! I had to fetch some water. Nasty. I filled the pot with water. Then guess who is it in now? The foxes! Go away! Cluck the hungry, the angry hands, and don't come back, quack the ducks. And Danny's quack is the loudest. Quackety quack, he says. Don't come back. Quack, quack.